Now, in a horrific incident, 14 civilians died in a firing incident in Tiru village area in Nagaland's Mon district on Saturday evening. One Jawan also lost his life in the firing incident. In fact, Nagaland Chief Minister now orders an SIT probe into the incident, promised justice. Home Minister Amit Shah has also tweeted over the incident, express grief. Let's take a look at how the incident transpired. <laughs> It all started when security forces planned a special operation against insurgents in Nagaland's Mon. After specific intelligence inputs about movements of insurgents, they stopped a group of people from Otting village returning home from a local coal mine, suspecting they were terrorists. And according to reports, opening fire. Six people driving in a mini truck died on the spot. A local search party of villagers, which came looking, went berserk after discovering the bodies. Sources reveal that angry villagers then surrounded the forces in protest and set their vehicles on fire, forcing the Assam Rifles troop to retaliate, resulting in more casualties. One Assam Rifles personnel died in the attack and many other security personnel were injured. <laughs> Assam Rifles issued a statement after the incident and regretted the aftermath of the operation, which it said was aimed at tracking insurgents. It also initiated a high-level probe and promised to take appropriate action as per law. Nagaland CM Nefio Rio ordered an SIT probe into the incident and promised justice. That operation was carried out that on based on uh, introduced with army claims, not by Assam rebels, but by one para unit of army. That's right. Okay. Okay. And uh, there's a counter insurgency operation. So the the team came into Nagaland and then, uh, uh, you know, based on some intelligence inputs as being stated in the statement. Yeah, based on some intelligence, that there's a movement, uh, a movement of underground cadre, right. reportedly by NST and YEJK. Home Minister Amit Shah also tweeted over the incident, promising justice and expressed grief. Congress MP Rahul Gandhi hit out at the government and called the incident heart-wrenching. Rajya Sabha MP from Nagaland, KG Kenye, promised to take the fight for justice to parliament. Oh, it's shocking. Highly condemnable. So one question that I want to know, uh, by any uh, uh, chance, uh, will you be raising this in the parliament uh, tomorrow? Certainly. I will seek uh, permission from the chairman in the zero hours. The famous Hornbill Fest in Kohima has been stopped after the incident. With Indrajit Kundu, Bureau Report, India Today. Oh, no!